From meetings to, scar to school carpools, rather, even summer trips, we spend a lot of time in our cars, and it's important to make sure that they're as safe as they possibly can be. So to help us out, we have Melissa from Tire Outlet. She's the general manager of the Beach Boulevard location. Welcome to First Coast Living. Nice to see you. Likewise, nice well, to see you. I smell the tire right here. Yes. For, and you can smell it miles <laughs> away. So tell us, it's National Tire Safety Week. What does that mean? Basically, each year the National Tire Manufacturers Association designates a week where we focus and educate our consumers on tire safety and proper vehicle maintenance. And, and it also coincides with the Memorial Weekend, which is the, the kickoff to the summer, especially with all the traveling that's going on. Yeah, because everybody's ready to take a Memorial Day trip for sure. That's everybody's right. already gearing up for it. So you have a tire here and you brought it for a reason because you have something that you call the t the penny test. Yes. Talk to us about this. Okay, so as professionals, we have tools that can inspect the tires, but there, here's a simple tip that you can do right at home. What you do is you take your tire and you take a, a penny and you want to face with Abe Lincoln face down, right there at the wear bar. Once you do that, if you can see his head at all, then that means it's time, it's a good indicator that it's time to go ahead and replace your tires. If you, you know, pretty much invisible and you can't see the head, then... Oh, look at that. Yeah. Oh, wow, that's a good idea. Yep. Okay. Who knew that it could be that simple? That's a great tip. Yep. Okay, so let's talk about tire safety then. Why is it really important to actually have good tires? All right. Um, well, tire safety is really important because while your brakes are designed to stop your vehicle, it's actually your tires that provide enough tread to it to make your car come to a stop. So if your brakes are working, that's fine and good. But if you don't have the proper tread, then your car doesn't have any grip to the road and it won't be able to stop. Okay, I'll tell you a story. This is a personal story, which I'm sure some people can relate to. And I'll just say female perspective here. I don't right. know any better. I had tires that I, I took in uh, my car and they came, they brought me out and said, you need to take a look at your tires. I literally had wire coming oh, through on the tires. And I said, I'm sure it's fine. I figured that grips the, the tread a little, the, the, the right. ground a little better. Am I incorrect? You are, the, the wire is actually part of the, the bead of your, of your tire. So that's actually the structure. If you have wires showing, you're definitely in danger of your car having a serious malfunction, your tire will literally like blow out. So if you have wires, you definitely need to get to us ASAP because otherwise you might have a, a really unfortunate accident. And then that. Tire Outlet, you also do other things other than tires. So we do. what other things do you offer there? We offer complete auto care. So anything from brake inspections to full inspections of your vehicle. We also do alignments and suspension work. Do you have any ladies' days that ladies can come out and, and learn about tires? <laughs> well, they can come any day. We're open Monday through Saturday, um, 8 to 5, Monday through Friday, and, and 7, um, 7.30 to 5 on Saturdays. Um, we do have a special ladies' day on Wednesday, so they can come out for a discounted rate on that. But we offer also um, throughout this entire week at any of our nine locations, we offer free tire rotation, um, tire inspections, oh. as well as brake inspections. See, so I should have been there for a tire inspection, you're yes. saying, for a couple of months yeah, ago. Oh, I needed charge. you. Yep. I needed no you. <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> okay, and so then as far as tires go, is there a certain time frame that you need to actually change your tires, or is it literally just as much traveling as you do? Okay, well, a couple things you want to keep in mind is you want to change out your tires, try to keep it to every six years. Um, you want to also make sure it's certain that you're checking your tire pressure. So every 30 days, once a month, check your tire pressure. And if you're not certain of what your tire pressure should be, it's located within your owner's manual. You can also look at it in the driver's um, inner part of your door. Um, lastly, um, you and you have easy numbers to, mm -hmm. use, to do for that, right? Right. What are the easy numbers? Easy numbers, um, every six to 8,000 miles, um, you want to rotate your tires and then every six years replace your tires and then the last number would be to check your PSI or your tire pressure and that again is on your owner's manual. Okay and so checking tire pressure when you go you just go to to you for instance or if mm -hmm. you want to try and do it on your own can you go to some place and just actually check it on your own? How do you do that? You can check it on your own. Some gas stations have the little air pump where you can go look at that but we strongly encourage if you're not familiar with how to operate your vehicle and check the tire 
come see us. We're not. There's no obligation. We're happy to help you out. I like that. We need a consult on tires. I, yeah. need, I need to wrap up with you guys. That's right. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you so much. Thank and you. thank you to Tire Outlet for sponsoring this segment. They have nine locations across Northeast Florida. You can also learn more on tireoutlet.com.